LWO on WeatherNet. Uh, liftoff conditions looking pretty good. ESTS is ready for launch. Ignition. Liftoff. Falcon 9 has cleared the tower. Ten. Nine. Eight. Side booster ignition. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Ignition. Stop. Go Falcon. Go Dragon. Got speed. Axiom one. Together, a new chapter begins. Godspeed AX-1. Stage one propulsion is nominal. Stage one throttle down. Throttling down in the preparation for max dynamic pressure. Falcon 9 is supersonic. Thank you. Stage one throttle up. Merlin 1D engines coming Stage back up to power. Engine. One Bravo. Copy, one Bravo. Next event coming up. We're going to get main engine cutoff Stage of the one main engines. Down. Get stage separation and ignition of the second stage engine. You've heard the throttle down call out. We're holding three and a half G's for the crew. And Miko. Successful stage separation, ignition of the second stage engine. Second stage, we see the engine nozzle glowing red. Everything continuing to look good on the second stage. We should be hearing call outs coming up to the crew here shortly on how the trajectory is looking. Dragon SpaceX, trajectory nominal. What would you like to hear? Acquisition of signal, Bermuda. An AOS Bermuda, acquisition of signal. The Bermuda tracking station now getting telemetry from the second stage of the Falcon 9 with the Dragon on top. Everything continues to be nominal. First stage coasting to Apogee, and then it will come back down for landing on the drone ship. Second stage partway through its lengthy burn to get the crew into orbit. So Kate, four and a half minutes in, Everything continues to look good. What a absolutely picture perfect liftoff. We've got a live view of the crew inside Dragon Endeavor. Looks like uh, everyone is still pretty comfy. The next event is second engine cutoff or SECO. One, as you see it there on the timeline at the bottom of your screen. That's where we shut down the MBAC engine, or second okay, engine cutoff. Copy, Shannon. Time. Time shut down. All right, we got a live view of the crew inside Dragon Endeavor there on the right-hand side of your screen. SpaceX Endeavor, we copy. There you can see the nitrogen gas thrusters, so that's the puff of um, gas that you see there occasionally. That's used for uh, attitude control systems. We also utilize those grid fins that you see. There are four of them uh, placed around the booster, uh, and those grid fins also help steer for a precise landing. Um, either at Stage the one entry burn startup. Stage two flight All right, there we can see that that entry burn has begun. 
We are targeting a landing on our drone ship, a shortfall of Gravitas today. Everything continuing to look nominal with trajectory and uh, MVAC performance there. Previously, the booster was... Stage one entry burn shut down. That entry burn helps slow the booster down. It was going about 25 times the speed of sound. So we slow it down as it re-enters the dense part of the Earth's atmosphere. Stage one transonic. Stage one landing burn. Landing burn has begun for the first day, Dragon first stage. Six, nominal orbit insertion. All right, great news there. Dragon Endeavor, nominal orbit insertion. SpaceX Endeavor, we copy, and it's great to be here. Zero G, and we feel fine. Uh, for Crew Dragon Endeavor, there you can see a live view inside our Dragon. Looks like the crew is beginning to adjust to zero G. And if you look at the right hand side yeah. corner, it looks like indicator. we can see the zero G indicator. Yeah. That was one of my. That, that was one of the things I really wanted to see what they were going to bring for their zero G indicator. So I can't wait to see what comes on. It looks. I can't quite tell. Pokemon. <laughs> uh, maybe. Okay. Well, hopefully it'll it'll come into closer view. Yeah. But and if not, we'll get to ask them later. Hopefully. Stage one landing leg deploy. SpaceX Dragon launch skip system disarmed. As you can see, this Falcon 9 has landed for the fifth time. All the while, great commentary Stage there. Confirmed. While we can confirm the landing. Confirmed landing there of the first stage booster. Also, almost simultaneously, great news uh, for the second stage. We heard that there was nominal orbit insertion. Right now, the second stage is about 200 kilometers above Earth. Preparing now for stage separation. Or, excuse me, for dragon separation. For those of you that have just recently joined us, we had an on-time liftoff of the Axiom-1 crew. They are now in space and uh, are coming up to separation from second stage, at which point um, they will then begin to make their journey, continue their journey uh, to the International Space Station. The view that you're currently looking at is inside the Dragon trunk which, as you can see, has just separated from the second stage. Dragon separation confirmed. On behalf of the Falcon 9 team, Thanks, welcome to space. To Thanks for flying Falcon 9. You guys, enjoy your trip to that wonderful space station in the sky. Do some great research for us to see you back here underground. Now, stand by for some words from LD. And MLA and, and uh, the rest of the crew endeavor. Glad we got to have some fun this morning. We'll probably be calling an early weekend over here at the Cape. Pass you over to Anna and the team. You'll be in good hands. Godspeed, Endeavor. Enjoy the rest of your flight. Cheers.